everyone. I'm Libby. And a girlfriend asked me this weekend what digital thriving means to me, why I'm working on this. Most people know I'm training around somatic healing, around embodiment work. So what does digital thriving have to do with this? And I'm going to share both about my own work as well as what I'm learning through one of the places that I'm receiving some coaching. So with digital thriving, I want you to imagine a time when you were a child where you were just playing outside. There was no buzzing of your phone. There was no LinkedIn notifications, no Facebook accounts. There was no Instagram reels. I really want you to imagine just the feeling of sun on your face and the feeling of your own body and invite you into an exploration of the depth of what you could feel. Your attention wasn't completely being taken into a virtual reality. For me, as someone who's oriented toward relationship building and future building, who foresees levels of collaboration that the world doesn't have yet, who helps people reimagine intimacy in their lives and reconnect to their innate creativity. I could not have imagined any of these things without distance from technology. And I also don't feel I can work on any of these things without working on technology. And the reason for that is that tension matters so much. Attention matters in life, but especially when you're starting to get clear, bold, big, going into the unknown, going into what's scary, pulls out so much fear, so much longing, so much frustration. It takes a deep, deep capacity to stay committed to what you care about to keep taking steps forward in those voids. Me creating the effort of digital thriving is about creating a world where human intelligence and human creativity is fueling how we use technology rather than technology and the agendas of those who have created it fueling our own intelligence and creativity. This being said, I have also sought out help on my own journey with this because just like everyone else in the world, I'm learning, I'm growing up, I'm building a career in the midst of this rapidly changing digital social environment. It's been such a gift right now in my life at the end of the 2023, as I'm building my businesses to discover Consciously Digital, an organization in the UK, and really just get this playful and fun deep dive into attention and identity work and transformation. And I just want to share a couple of themes that I'm learning there. I really offer this foundation based in James Clear's Atomic Habits that transformational work requires identity change. So rather than just policing our habits, forcing ourselves to move or shift or change, we want to get to really ground ourselves in who we want to become and then play and practice and allow ourselves to be human in the process of bringing our own attention back into our control and our choosing. I feel so grateful to be in an environment that's helping me play as someone who takes all this quite seriously. Also to be encouraged back into my humanity. There's a lot in the coaching fields that's deeply serious for good reason. It's hard to lose weight, to change your eating habits. It's hard to change your wealth identity, expand your heart and to become a better communicator and to have someone helping you in, an, in a space where there can be so much shame in the digital environment, just doing it so playfully, so encouraging of testing, so encouraging of self-compassion, so encouraging of kindness has been so deeply grounding. So I just want to encourage you wherever you're at to pause to breathe, to remember your own intelligence, your own creativity. And if you felt overwhelmed within your work environment, within your personal life, know that you're completely not alone. You can reach out to me for work on digital thriving. I highly, highly encourage you to reach out to Consciously Digital and just raise the conversation so that this overwhelm does not have to be something that people suffer with privately. I really want to just give a shout out to Anastasia and the Consciously Digital team for reminding me and bringing back into my energy right now this sense of joyful play and the reminder of our own humanity in this process.